Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. As you guys know, on my Riberhood Challenge, I deposit $200 every single week to invest into the stock market. Now, I'm trying to grow my dividend Robinhood account. This week, I'm going to show you what exactly am I buying with my $200 on my Robinhood account. And also, if you haven't signed up yet, I'm doing a free giveaway of a high paying monthly dividend stock, AGNC. So if you click the link down in the description, it'll take you to the contest and you have a chance to win a free dividend giveaway. Also, if you stick around to the end of this video, you will see an extra buy that I'm going to do in this video. So make sure that you stick around to the end of this video to find out exactly what I'm investing in. But enough talk, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. Welcome back YouTube. If we take a look at my portfolio, right now I'm sitting at $15,766. On the day, I'm up $75. On the week, I'm up $208. And over the last month, I'm up 8.62%, up $1,250. So I had a pretty solid month going on so far. Hopefully I have another good month this month in order for me to completely recover my account, okay? If you see right here, I got $202 worth of cash that I'm going to buy some dividend paying stocks right now live. So here we go, guys. The first one that I'm going to buy is a company that has been doing extremely well ever since the outbreak, ever since the beer virus news has been going on. This company has actually been doing uh, much better since the news come out. And that company is CLX Clorox. So if we take a look at Clorox, they're up 1.5% on the day. And we look at the last three months, they're actually up 24% over the last three months. So the news actually helped this company out uh, tremendously, okay? So it's up $40 since um, the news actually came out. Uh, I have bought two shares back at $176. And my total return, I'm up 17% from Clorox alone. And this company pays out a dividend of 208 Okay, so this company is not only paying a hefty dividend, but it's also outperforming and doing well ever since the news came out. While some some companies are going bankrupt, this company is doing extremely well, and that is a dividend type of company that I want to invest in. So I'm going to buy fifty dollars worth of Clorox CLX. All you have to do is click buy, and I'm going to change it from shares to buy in dollars so i could buy fractional shares i'm going to buy 50 dollars worth of clorox review swipe up to, to to continue and there we go i have 50 dollars worth of clorox into my robin hood account all right so i have 150 dollars left the next company that i'm going to buy has also been doing extremely well in the stock market ever since the news and that company is probably a company that you guys use uh very very often and that is wmt walmart if we take a look walmart over the last day is up almost half a percent 63 cents of the last week down a little bit but over the last month they're up 1.9 percent and ever since the news came out walmart is up 6.7 percent so if you would have bought some stocks of walmart when it first came out um, when the news first came out you would actually be up 6.73 percent I'm currently up on Walmart, um, $2.59, almost 0.3%. And Walmart pays a dividend of 1.76%. So I'm not afraid to invest 50 more dollars into this company. Um, the news is actually driving this company to outperform what it has been doing over the last couple of months before the news came out. So I'm gonna buy $50 worth of Walmart right now. Hit buy, $50, review, and swipe up to continue okay so that leaves me with a hundred dollars guys so the next companies that i'm going to invest into are my monthly paying dividend stocks one of them that i'm going to invest into is sphd it is a monthly paying dividend stock it's the power shares inside the s p 500 over the last three months it has took a big hit it's down 25 percent and so my average cost was $41.20. So I'm going to average in on SPHG and try to get some while the price is $10 lower than my average cost. 
and this one has been paying me dividends every single month so i'm going to try to continue to grow sphd while it's on sale so i'm going to buy a couple of shares of sphd right now this one pays a dividend of 5.72 percent so it pays out monthly and the dividends are pretty high and it's in the s p 500 so let's click buy i'm going to change it from dollars to shares and i'm going to buy one share of SPHD. Okay, and the next one I'm gonna buy is AGNC. This is also a monthly paying dividend stock. Right now on a total of 82 shares of AGNC over the last three months is down 36%. So I'm gonna to try to get this one also on the steal. This is a monthly paying dividend stock. And I'm gonna to try to get um, up to 100 shares of AGNC over the next couple of months. Right now I'm at 82. Uh, let's change that to 85 and buy three more shares of AGNC. I'm gonna click buy three, three shares of AGNC. Click review, swipe up to buy, and there you go. Now I have 85 shares of AGNC, 15 more shares to go until I have 100 shares of AGNC. And the last one I'm gonna buy is the most risky one in my portfolio. It has a high dividend uh, yield. They actually just cut that dividend yield, which brought down the price, but the company seems to still be doing well. It's NRZ uh, of the last three months, they're down 63%. Uh, but this company has a dividend yield now of 3.03%. It used to be 14%, so they did cut their dividends. But it's a uh, it's a real estate, it's a REIT, so they do have to pay out their dividends, and I do believe they're gonna raise it in the future. Um, right now I could get NRZ for a steal at six dollars and thirty-five cents. In fact, if we go down, they just had their earnings, their Q1 earnings uh, last week. They expected their earnings to be down negative seventeen cents, but actually they actually beat their goal and they're almost on par here's a, a red dot red dot red dot red dot red dot and it's actually showing that they're kind of doing all right they're not as bad as they used to be so as soon as the um economy starts doing well again and the uh new residential uh investment company starts to pay back out their dividends if i could get a whole bunch at six dollars and 34 cents and then it eventually recovers all the way back up to 15 dollars and they raise their dividends again dividend portfolio will be performing extremely well so let's buy a couple shares of nrz let's try to buy five review make it a limit order and swipe up to continue done and there we go i have completed five shares of nrz so there we go, guys. If you guys do want a free share of AGNC, make sure you click the link down in the description. If you click that link, it signs you up for a contest and you'll I'll be giving out a free share of AGNC on Sunday in a couple of days from now. So make sure that you don't miss that. If you stuck around to the end of this video, that's great. I'm about to show you another investment that I'm about to do for $200. And I'm going to buy... Bitcoin. So I'm over here on Coinbase. If you don't have a Coinbase account, it is the easiest way to sign up and buy Bitcoin straight from your phone. I'm about to show you how to buy Bitcoin. I'm going to buy $200 worth of Bitcoin. I believe Bitcoin is going to be somewhere around $200 to $500,000 somewhere in August of 2021. So I'm going to stack up on some Bitcoin right now. I'm going to buy $200 worth of Bitcoin right here in my Coinbase portfolio. Show you guys exactly how easy it is. All you do is click on Bitcoin. Sign up, create your account. The link will be down in the description. If you sign up, deposit $100, you'll get $10 and I'll get $10. And so that'll help you grow your Bitcoin account even faster. So I'm going to buy $200 worth of Bitcoin. And hopefully next year, this $200 worth of Bitcoin will be worth somewhere at around the $2,000, $3,000 worth of Bitcoin. Okay, guys. So if we look here, Bitcoin was up to almost $9,100 couple of days ago now it's down to eight thousand five hundred dollars so down a little bit of zero percent uh negative point zero three percent hit trade hit buy bitcoin with cash i linked it to my bank account i'm going to type in two hundred dollars one time purchase um hit preview buy 
There it goes. By now, it's 0 0.02295931 worth of Bitcoin at the price of $8,580. I do want to accumulate one full Bitcoin before the bull run goes. So I got a long way to go before I have one full Bitcoin worth on my Coinbase account. And there it goes, guys. I successfully purchased uh, some Bitcoin. So if you guys want to sign up for Robinhood, the link will be down in the description. Don't forget to sign up for the contest where you can win a free share of AGNC. And if you want to start your Bitcoin portfolio, use Coinbase. That link is also down in the description. But other than that, I just wanted to show you guys what I was investing in this week. Uh, what stocks was I buying? Why were I buying them? And show you guys how to invest into Bitcoin. But other than that, I'm Zeke bringing you the Dream Green Show. And I'm out. Peace.